Fiona, we taught, um, got about three, well, it was 20, I know, I know what date it was, the 22nd of March, and it was 2022, when we talked about setting up our community interest company um, to help women, to keep women in business through their cancer journey. And you were part of that because you have phased it and come out the other side. I'm now on a new journey, one I hadn't expected, and one that really has obviously taken us all a bit by surprise that I'm now that woman in that terms of reference and I'm <laughs> and I'm now facing into that um, and at this stage um, it is at, at stage one and because of all the things we were doing to grow the business we took a step back from the CIC didn't we yeah. but I think for me now we was already in the plan to go forward but we are talking to more and more women and now I am that woman in that own terms of reference where when we are at hospital appointments or we're trying to balance things, you know, who is helping us run our business? And you're not getting paid for that. No, we're not getting paid for that. And also when we're worried about our hair, etc., and having support for that as well, yeah. you know, and, and you know, because how many amazing women do help with what you Fine. do? Mm. Yeah, and obviously they're not getting the money so they can't afford it. Because yeah. I donate a lot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you, you absolutely do donate. You can't keep doing it. No, you can't. You, the other way. Absolutely, you can't keep donating, you can't keep supporting. And I've started this journey and I'm looking at benefits. And yet again, the same with menopause when I was faced with that, it was considering uh, uh, you know, downscaling your business. So I dread to think how many business women we are losing through that. So the whole point of our CIC is to keep women in business through their cancer journey. Absolutely by providing personal and professional services. Um, and we know there's an absolute call for that. By creating the CIC, then we know that we can generate the income from our amazing Stronger Together branded clothing. And then from that, we can help and support women while they are in hospitals or why they are, you know, they're having yeah. support through that it journey. It takes weight off their mind, doesn't it, really? Yeah. It's one less thing to worry about. It's one less thing to worry about, absolutely. And also in, in your group, you do that within your booby club as well, yes. don't you? you booby brunch. You do that and support those. <laughs> yeah. Again, because you, you're you amazed. It's why I love you being part <laughs> of, of my team. Is because you've been there and you're paying it forward and, and sharing it and supporting yeah. all those amazing women. Support, isn't it? And I think when you've got your own business, you can be quite lonely and isolated on your own. Yes. And then, yeah, having people to reach out to for finance and for support yeah. is really good. Absolutely, you? it is. And it's and I look back and this is how, Im how important it is, you know, to have you, the right people around you. But I look at those terms of reference then, I look at where I am now and I'm facing into that journey myself. It's given me more passion to really help and support other women like us because your testament, you've yeah. come out the other side and then we can support because what we will do, adamantly do, is we will keep women in business despite whatever life throws at them as well. Yeah.